Hello and welcome to the most stupid thing I have ever done in my life. Yes. You are reading the title correct. You are reading it right. I am going to lap the Nürburgring Nordschleifer. 200 laps, the longest possible race that you can do on Gran Turismo. It's for the Philippine School Project. They help build and equip schools in the Philippines. And it's a very good cause. I'm sure you'll agree. <laughs> this is going to go on for a minimum of 27 hours. Yes, that's right, a minimum of 27. I'm doing it against AI. I think this is, I don't want to kill other people by inviting them to this race. I'm using the McLaren 650S, which um, Ford's delivery guy made a really nice delivery for me. And there it is. And number of laps. Flick that all the way over to the right. Boom, 200. <laughs> okay, there it is. The settings, all done. Let's jump in. Oh my God. Before we start, I'm gonna walk around a little bit. Oh yeah. I'm gonna stay well hydrated, kids. Ready? <laughs> <laughs> what am I doing? Honestly, oh. what are we doing here? Honestly that's such a well-timed <laughs> donation. Right, here we go. The beginning of the end for me. Oh, God. Stupid AI. Look at them going like two miles an hour. Watch them break really early. They are idiots. Okay, so I've turned my force feedback down a little bit. And I'll probably turn it down even more. By the end, I'll probably be on 0%. So lots of people asking about how will I go to toilet? I will just pause the game. There's no auto drive here. Look, I can just pause it. I will take breaks. Don't worry, I'm not going to completely kill myself. I do apologise, right? I apologise now if I go very quiet at times or if I ignore the chat or whatever. I'm sure you can forgive me. For the first sort of 12 hours, I might be alright, but then as soon as I start getting sleepy, then that's when things will go downhill. Now, on this very long straight, I could look away from the screen and rest my eyes a little bit. Look out the window. Get a bit cloudy actually. Oh man, what am I doing with my life? <laughs> okay, one lap up, eight minutes 29. But I'll go for this lap and proper go for it and see how quick we can go. Here we go. Okay, that's not too promising really, is it? That's my, my mum has just donated 300 pounds to the cause. Thank you, mama. The children will be ever thankful. Blue flag song intensifies. Did he break around that corner? That is amateur hour. Absolute amateur hour over here. Why are they, I mean, they are taking completely the wrong line. Oof, he's parking in the middle. I was actually really nervous about starting this. I've been thinking about it a lot this week. Because, I, oh, what the? <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> Didn't see that coming. Okay, lap number 10. We're into double digits. Why is he on the right-hand side? What's he doing? Very defensive line. Send. Controller. Here we go. Oh, man. I'm feeling a bit of ache already. Oh, ho, ho. Good old chase cam, eh? What a blast from the past this is. For those of you who just tuned in, perfect timing. You still have... 80% of the race left to watch which is approximately 22 hours or something big regrets right now yeah <laughs> doing it for the children doing it for the children out of freaking way mate out of the way this is for the children the Philippines It's like the trailer. 
There's always a spinning car around the Nurburgring in the Gran Turismo trailer. I don't think I ever want to play this game again after this. Ever. I don't, I don't think I want to do sim racing ever again after this. I don't think I ever want to go to the Nurburgring after this. I should do a 69,420 lap race next. You can't call yourself a pro until you've done a 69,420 lap race of this track. Oh, it's the Beetle. I can ram him off again. I love ramming off the Beetle. Oh no! <laughs> there we go. Sorry mate, didn't see you there. Wait, I want to kind of fix this quickly. We've done it. Right. So we are now into the unknown. I've never done more than 50 laps on this track. And we're on to lap 51. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, yes, we've done it. Thank you so much, everyone. He's done it! <laughs> He's done it! Yeah. He's done it! Right. 3,000 raised. I'm sure we can get well above 10 now. These peanuts are good. All right, go on in. Here we go. Legit can of rich energy. Oh. Please keep 999 on speed dial just in case just in case my condition goes goes south very quickly. Post, post rich energy. The real Momos. Oh no. Momos has entered the chat. Come at me, Momos. 1v1 me, bro. Right now I feel much more comfortable than I did, let's say, 30 laps ago. I don't know if that is because I'm on lap 69. It makes me cry every time. <laughs> The end of lap 69. That was a good lap. I really enjoyed that lap. It's so I'm really sorry to see it go. Lap 70. At the end of this lap, I have done 35% of the race. Well, it's gone midnight. Now, it's gone midnight. So I can say, I am going to finish this race today. <laughs> and thank you, Pepsi. Right, here we go. Let's go for it. This lap is very close so far, with the fastest. Every sector is like a tenth, within a tenth. Hmm, that wasn't that quick. Let's see. Still about a tenth, within a tenth. Oh! Gain three tenths on that sector. Come on, this could be the 804. Ah, oh, no! to that corner pretty quick. Not the one before it though. Oh, still a bit quicker. Hey, 4,000. Nice. Come on. Boom. 8.04. Fantastic lap there, Lewis. That's P1. Thank you, Thea. Ah, good to see you. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for dropping by. Do it for the kids. Never lose sight of that. We're doing it for the children. And they shall be ever grateful for our sacrifice on this fateful day. We've raised 4,000 so far, guys. This is, a, this is amazing. Okay, right. I need to go for a pee. I need to open the window. Shall I open, open the window go for a pee out of the window? Not sure my neighbours will like that. Oh, my arms. Oh, right. What are we on? Nearly 10 hours now. Nearly 10 hours. Okay. Let's crack on. You know what I need to do? I'm going to... I need to get my glasses. Put my glasses on. Oh, it's been a while since I've had these on. Thank you, Florian, again. Oh, here we go. Geeky Super GT is back. Okay. It's red. It smells like blue paint. Red paint. Way. 
really regretting my life right now. <laughs> really, really strongly regretting it. Yeah, I've still got about 16 hours left. <laughs> or more than. <laughs> what am I doing? Right, here we go everyone. I am about 20 seconds away from halfway. How long have we been going? 13 hours, 45 minutes. Half. I'm halfway there. We are now... We are... We're now going out of the forest, not into it. So, let's go out of the forest. Damn it, Marduk's back. How you doing, man? I'm still here. 400 laps. Who would sign up for 400 laps? Okay, time for probably the biggest break I'll take in this whole event. 60% done. Like a massive imprint on my thumb. Right, we'll leave it there. I'll be back in a bit. Anyone who's just joined, I just had a shower. Um, we've, we've done 60% of the race, um, so obviously 40% left, 80 laps left to go. I feel a little bit better after that shower. I still feel tired. I'm very tired. Uh, just lacking energy. I've, I've put a load of food on two laps and then I'll go and then I'll go and eat. So I'll just do that now while we're waiting for the food to finish up. Right. I'm going to go and eat now. So I'll be back in a minute. Okay, are we ready to rock and roll for the remaining, remaining, the remaining, I can't even talk anymore, that's how bad it's got, for the remaining 77 laps, 78, I've got to do lap 123 as well, 78 laps, let's stop pissing about, get on with it. Lol. Well, we are departing lap 168. We're entering the fabled 169. On wets. Off go the super softs. On go the wets. Oh man. Lap 169 on the wets. And we hit the target. 10,000 pounds raised. Five digits. Awesome work, everyone. 31 laps. It's basically a sprint. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, don't go and retry. Do not go anywhere near that button. Playing with fire right there. Thank you, Tiffany, for the donation. We've, we've stumbled across a new genre of ASMR motorsport. Never thought that would be a thing. Maybe this video, this live stream will go down in history as one of the most viewed ASMR videos of all time. Do I have any regrets looking back? Yeah, I mean, turn four, lap 83. I was about that far from the apex and that's just unforgivable really, isn't it? I'm, t I'm honestly disgusted at myself for missing the apex by that much. Apart from every lap between about lap 80 and 130, when I felt like absolute death, I regret all of those laps. Absolute units! I don't know how I've survived. I just got this really good second wind. And I'm thankful that happened because I was not in a good place. Right, we need to um, kill Chang, don't we? We want uh, Jean-Claude Van Damme to win. Or finish second. First of the AI. I don't know, five more minutes and then I've been going for 24 hours. Look at that. Bottom left. Oh, oh my god. I need to hydrate. I'm going to get some water. 10,777 pounds. Yeah, what card do you think I'm going to get on the daily... on the daily spin thing? Honda Jazz, yes. 
Oh yeah, I'm gonna get two two rewards in one go because I've done same race over two different days. Just one more pit stop remaining after this one. Oh my god. Oh. Are my arms hurting? Not really. I think I've put it on really low force feedback, so I haven't really had to put too much stress through my arms. To be honest, this last sort of two hours has seemingly gone on forever. It really has. Let's get to 190. I can't wait to see 190. I can't wait to see 200, but it's your back. My back's actually just fine, honestly. This seat is just perfect. I just realised, right? I've only, I didn't even take any of my Pro Plus, and I didn't. I only took one Rich Energy, and I didn't take any of the Red Bulls I had. Hey, Super GT, do you want to join my open lobby? Do you want to race me after you do your 200 laps? Yeah, I do, mate. Yep. Oh, we're a lap and a half away from glory. And the most stupid challenge you can possibly do on Gran Turismo Sport. Well, special stage route X in a Samba bus could be more stupid, but the most realistic, but also stupid challenge you could do. There were times throughout this thing where I was like, I actually can't do this. <laughs> I genuinely can't do it, but I'm glad I persevered because I'm here now, nearly on that 200. Woo! There it is! Final lap! Oh, lap 200! I went on the internet this week and I found this. I've got to get a photo. Lap 200. Right, here we go. Lap 200. Let's get this stupid race done. <laughs> what am I doing? Such a stupid idea. No, it's a good idea. We've raised £14,000. Lap 200. I'm so happy to see that. I am so happy to see final lap. You can't believe how happy I am. How sore are my arms? They're not too bad, actually, honestly. Like, I can. I think I might retire the car. It's feeling a bit off. I started the stream at 2 pm yesterday afternoon. It's now 8 pm the day after. Well, it's nearly 8 pm. That is almost 30 hours I've spent here. Here we go, everyone. It's the end. Um, well, I always want to start by saying a big thank you to all this, this crowd. I mean, you guys have been amazing. F***ing done it. <laughs> Get in there, Lewis. Get in there, Lewis. <laughs> Miracles do happen, mate. F*** it out. Oh! He did it! Get in there, Lewis. Miracles do happen, mate. Oh, man. He did it! Oh, David Peril, thanks, mate. I only got 200,000 credits! What a sick joke. Oh, cheers everyone. That was mad. I actually freaking did it though. Chang got second, Van Damme. Oh, it doesn't say who... Okay, we lapped Renault 21 times. Uh, anyone else? Lap the full GT 18 times. Right, thank you so much everyone who's donated. 14,300 at the moment. Um, but for that, total will go up. And Right, here we go then. Oh, no, can't skip forwards. It crashes. Still happens on the PS5. <laughs> oh, man. Right, let's do a, a report of how I feel. It's just that weird mark. But it's not too bad. And my thumb has a weird imprint on it. Look. 
I don't know. I don't think you see how deep that is. It just feels a bit weird. Um, I don't know. I feel all right. Wait, let me get out. Maybe I won't feel all right. Oh, I feel, a bit, I feel really heavy. Or oh, my legs feel really weak. My legs feel really weak, actually. Like I've, it's like I've cycled for like five hours or something. Oh, man. Yeah, 200 laps of Route X now. That was just a warm up. Ninja roll, wait. I reckon I can do one. <laughs> Into a backflip, yeah? See it, of course. Hey, yeah. <laughs> Fifteen thousand. We hit fifteen. Yes. Uh, you see on the screen there. Fifteen. We hit fifteen thousand before the end of the stream. It will. We'll still go up, as we said. But fifteen k. Thank you so much, everyone. Honestly, that's going to be. It's going to be such a crazy amount for this for this charity. Okay, guys. So I just wanted to give you an update. This is one week later or just over a week later after the event and i wanted to talk about how much we actually raised in the end and how it felt to do that event which was ridiculous and yes i am here i am alive i didn't die so that's good news okay so how much did we raise at the end of the stream it was fifteen thousand. ultimately after a few more days we raised twenty five and a half thousand pounds twenty five thousand five hundred pounds which is just crazy absolutely an amazing amount so thank you anyone who's donated absolutely mental i can't believe actually we raised that much because my initial goal was only three thousand which i then raised to 10 we smashed that and then got 25 and a half so i was actually speaking with kelvin at the philippine school project earlier today and he was saying about the numbers and how much that money can help uh, for example like nine thousand can build an entire classroom and equip it as well so, you know, 25 and a half is obviously going to go a very, very, very long way to helping the children in the Philippines. So I think it was just an awesome thing to do. Now, further down the line, hopefully once travel restrictions are eased, hopefully I would like to go to the Philippines. I would like to go to the schools and see firsthand, you know, what they're, uh, what they're spending the money on and how it's improving uh, the schools. Um, so that could be a video, hopefully further down the line, but um, it may well be more than a year away. So we don't know about that yet, but hopefully I'll be able to do that. So how did it feel to do that? Because I was awake for 34 hours in total. I was awake two hours before the stream started, two hours after, and the stream itself was 30 hours. The race itself was 27 hours, 40 minutes. And then we had a couple of hours of downtime, pausing, um, taking breaks whatever so i was awake for 34 hours in total uh, the race 27 hours of that or 27 and a half and to be honest it wasn't a case of it getting worse and worse and worse in terms of how tired and exhausted i was for the first sort of 13 hours it felt fine I, i've done that before felt felt okay and then it hit about 2 a.m and that's when I started to get really tired. You can tell him in the in the live stream that my voice was going very quiet. I didn't really have much energy to speak and to do the race itself at the same time. So you might be surprised that actually live streaming can be quite tricky, like reading the chat, trying to process that whilst also racing, but then also being very tired. I think that didn't really help at all. So I didn't have much energy, but then I kind of got a second wind, maybe know 17 hours into the race and uh, matt amos actually joined the chat on discord with me so that actually really helped uh, to take my mind off of the tiredness and just have something have someone to talk to and then uh, the final sort of nine hours was bearable it wasn't too bad um but the sleep i got afterwards was the best sleep i have ever got i mean that isn't an exaggeration i slept I put it on Twitter 13 hours, but I think it was actually more like 15 hours I slept for, completely uninterrupted. As soon as I got into bed, instantly asleep. Um, and to be honest, actually, my sleep patterns have been a bit weird this week because um, I've, I've just felt tired at really weird times during the day. I've slept really early, really late. Uh, so my energy and my sleep is kind of all over the place because of that. But I think it was worth it. When we raised 25,000, 
I don't think we can uh, complain too much. Would I do it again? Probably not. I would honestly tell you it was it was really horrible to to be let's say on lap 50 you've already been going for seven hours but you know that you've still got 20 hours left you're going to be tired you're tired you're exhausted you're hungry and you can't stop you have to keep going and the slower you go the more you pause it the longer you're delaying the finish time um so it was it was really grueling mentally honestly it was it was it wasn't pleasant it really wasn't pleasant and i'm not sure i'd want to do that kind of thing again but if we could raise more money i, I guess you never know uh so i'm not going to completely rule it out that will bring a close to this video thank you so much for watching thank you so much for supporting me on the stream as well when it was live and of course thank you for the donations twenty five and a half thousand pounds the philippines school project i think it's a really good cause it's a really good amount of money it's going to go a long way to helping lots of children in the philippines which is for me just an amazing thing but take care everyone thank you so much for watching don't do 200 laps for the nurburgring because it is horrible but with that said i'll catch you next time thanks for watching goodbye